All right, Cake Eaters, here we are to talk about the 1967 Rankin and Bass classic, Mad Monster Park. <laughs> The poster says it all. We've got beautiful old school claymation. And I love that shit. The format alone has me sold, but what does IMDB say? On the Isle of Evil, the head of the World Organization of Monsters reveals his imminent retirement, and that he has refined the formula for total destruction, only to be upset when the monsters try to steal his formula and kill his nephew. Baron Boris von Frankenstein is voiced by Boris Korloff, and he is the head of the organization. He's planning on his human nephew and only living relative to take over when he retires. Felix is my only relative. And yeah. The monsters, they're not pleased by this, and a number of them think that they are the ones that should be the successor. I am his logical successor. This movie's nuts. Just a pinch of this, a pinch of that, uh, a pinch of this, <laughs> a pinch of that. Ouch. Anytime you have an hour and a half plus movie made in claymation, I am 100% in. Don't kill yourself. Who's gonna kill myself? I only said that because I didn't think anyone could hear me. This simply doesn't get the credit it deserves. It's not held in the high esteem that Rudolph, Frosty, the little drummer boy, all of his Christmas brothers are like S tier and for some reason this one is not talked about at all, but it is the Halloween season and this should be a staple. Don't kiss. You always leave marks. My apologies. Like so many movies from my childhood, I often forget how many songs were actually involved in these films. And this one is no exception. There are lots of songs. And some of them are good, but most of them are not. You gotta stay one step ahead. Stay one step ahead. The representations of all the classic movie monsters are pretty awesome. Just real fun and goofy characters. <laughs> The nephew Felix is kind of like a cross between Barney Fife and Urkel. He works in a pharmacy. Need I remind you that this is a drug store? There are people waiting at the lunch counter, and you're wasting your time in the pharmacy department. Frankenstein's monster is almost cute. He has kind of an innocence about him and his goofiness. His wife, however, she's kind of scarier than he is. Well, how do I look? It's a bit before my time, but even I could recognize Phyllis Diller from her claymation portrayal. I may never have really seen her in person, but I've seen enough of her drawn in different cartoons making cameos that you can just kind of pull her out and that just shows you how inspired her claymation version of her is. <laughs> So we have all the classic movie monsters, but they are kind of playing the off-brand versions of themselves because they didn't want to have to pay royalties. So they are called uh, The Creature, It, um, the, the Hunchback of Notre Dame, etc, etc. There's so many sets and they're all unique and fun with their own little awesome qualities. The visuals in general are crazy, especially for the time and claymation, awe-inspiring. It's great for all ages. For kids, it's this odd sense of wonder and a look that's timeless. And for adults, the plot alone is kooky as shit. And to be old enough to understand the work that was involved in making this and that it's from the 60s? Wow. Too many people haven't seen this. And I'll say it again, this, this is every bit as good and charming as the Christmas movies. But for some reason, this one is overlooked. And if you want to check it out, this is on YouTube right now, available for $3.99 to rent. This is a big recommend from me, so if you do check it out, let me know what you thought about it in the comments below. I'll see you next time. Until then, don't die in a fire, and as always, fuck off. Just daggers, you know that he's the sharpest in the shed with content, so killer that he left them all for dead. Yeah, cause like I said, no, he don't do this just for fun and never stop until the top because he's going number one. Just daggers, always cutting through the competition. Everybody listen, homie, he came up here on a mission, got him wishing that he could take a break to stunt, but the point's to stay sharp, ne never go blunt. Just daggers, 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 just daggers. Just daggers, just daggers, just daggers, just daggers.